guys so go ahead and invite your followers i'm going to be live streaming today so let me just flip the screen here what's going on guys so ryan stanelson here john hooper here john hooper he's going to be launching me my kite is right there i'm here at juno beach there's the stairs that go up to what is that? What what gate is it? Which uh which stair is that? 33. 33. 33. Scope day. What's up, Mike Lynn? I gotta call you back. So this is uh that's Kite Beach. You can see all the other kites there. You can see uh, uh Scott, there's Scott. So you can see all the kiters behind me. And uh my board is down there. So you're gonna launch me? Yep. Alright guys, I got my uh my my phone on my helmet. So you guys are gonna see some really good stuff here. It's blowing like 30 knots. It's probably about as good as I could ask for it to, to get right now. Uh, go ahead and invite your followers. I haven't been on for a while. I'm not really, there's some decent waves. It's probably about two foot, one to two foot. It's gonna get bigger as the day goes on. Really stoked to have you guys with. Let me flip this around, rip it up. You're gonna watch it. Okay, wait, now let me just make sure. I wanna do a, yeah, thanks for sharing, Mike. Nelson, Scott. Okay, so I want to make sure that this is level when I have it on. Okay, so I'm putting my helmet on right now. Yeah, let's okay. hold on one second. Okay, go ahead and make sure it's level. Is it, in other words, is it totally level? Or does it have to be moved up or down? If I'm good. looking, is it pretty level. good? I think it's level. Okay, like this. it'll probably jiggle down a little bit. That's pretty good though? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. All right. Woo! All right, there's my bar, my 30 meter lines that are going up to my kite. There's my board. I'm gonna get my, uh, my chicken loop attached to me here. Okay. There we go. So I guess, hopefully you guys can see that. That's how I attach myself as a safety to the uh, to the kite. Here's my chicken loop. So I'm just putting my I'm putting. See, this is this is why I'm saying you don't really need a lot of strength. All you need this is what hold, keeps you on the uh, on the kite, basically. Hold on one second. Let me just make sure that. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. So I got my kite launched. Thank you. I got a little bit of sand in my bar. Nobody here can get in my way. Guys launching out there. Woo! Grabbing my board. See, the waves aren't that big. I just actually did a live stream on Facebook. I'm gonna kind of get rinsed off here. Turn my board around. Get going this way. I'm off. Woo. Live stream number two. So it's blowing about 30, well about 25 knots, 20 to 27, 25 knots I'd say consistently. Here's where I, this is what I use to depower right here, this thing. Water's pretty darn crystal clear. I just came in from San Diego on Friday. I'm here for, uh, here for basically, woo, yeah. Nice little jump. Woo! Yeah! Woo! Easy to jump out here today. We got plenty of wind, plenty of juice. Kite's lit up, I'm lit up. Definitely am uh, amped up. Not good, not good to get too amped up. So, but what's good is, is I got plenty of power. So now I'm just, I just basically turn my, my feet around. Now I've got my front foot. I just switched my back foot to my front, uh, my front strap right there, and my front to my back. So I just turned around, I turned my feet around so that I can be going forward, going this way. And uh, yeah, invite your followers. This should be, uh, I gotta imagine that this would be woo, featured. I don't know. Call me crazy. Ain't nobody else doing this. <laughs> what do you think, Scotty? Ask for Ferguson. Ferguson. You better be inviting your followers, brother. I'm gonna be tearing up some waves here in a second. Oh 
yeah. What do we have here? Bam! Launched it. He almost died. Dang it. That would have been rad. Alright, this is so good right now. I'm telling you, like, I'm lit up. I've got so much wind right now. I've got the right size kite. I've got the right size board. I've got. The only thing I'm looking for is waves. Yeah! Yeah! A little rodeo! Yeah, that was rad! Alright, the waves are starting to pick up. That dude just freaking killed it! That was nuts! He just looped his kite! Like, full... Loop. That was nutty. <laughs> jump. He's gonna jump. He's gonna jump. Watch this. <laughs> he just. He knew I was. He knew I was recording, so he like went so big. <laughs> he just. He just bit. It. He just fine. Nobody can hear me because it's blowing like 30 knots. You guys might be able to hear me. As the day goes on, the wind's gonna get stronger. No, the wind will be about the same. The waves will get bigger. So now I'm just trying to get up wind trying to go up that way against the wind so that I can have more so that I can catch more waves like this little waves but still ah. yeah Woo! it feels so good to be out here Yeah. yeah, I mean, the reason why I put this goofy, I mean, the guys on the beach, I'm, I'm surprised, I mean, they kind of give me crap because I've got this, you know, yeah, a little toe side action on a bi-directional board, that's pretty sweet, um, they give me crap because, yeah! Woo! <laughs> so easy to catch air. Guys, I hope you see how fun this is. Um, that's my board right there underneath me. Uh, I'm riding what's called toe side right now. Now I'm not. Now I'm riding heel side. I'm going back up wind so that I can uh, so that I can basically go, you know, catch some more waves and go down wind. Super stoked. Super, super stoked to be here in Juno Beach. I flew in from San Diego on Friday. 
to be with my son. I come here once a month. And uh, if you don't know who I am, my name is Ryan Steinelson. Go ahead and follow me. I do a lot of action sports stuff. Primarily, I'm only scoping when I'm doing uh, when I'm doing my action sports stuff. Uh, we're going to be producing a uh, producing a lot of other action sports live events on our channel, ActionSports.Live. If you want to see more of this kind of stuff, woo! And go ahead and follow that channel where you're going to see kite surfers. You're going to see guys that are in squirrel suits, wing suits, flying through the mountains, all live for the first time ever in the world. And here's a boat out here. Check this out. Let's go check the boat out. Look the boat. Now, that's the other cool thing about kite surfing is, is that I can see all kinds of stuff out here that a boat couldn't see. Now, and I can go wherever I want to go. I can catch any way that I want to wait. I want to catch. And uh, I can jump in the air. I can fly. I don't know if you guys can see that boat. This guy's going out there to catch him too. Um, but... You know, typically, I'm not going to go all the way out there, but I'll see like uh, turtles, I'll see whales, I'll see porpoise, dolphin, uh, I mean, you name it, and I see it all because I'm totally stealth, I'm just, it's totally, you know, basically I can, I can sneak up on them because my board is completely quiet. So. Yeah, hopefully you guys can hear me over the wind and uh, super stoked to have you on. If you want to you follow some really good people, uh, there's a guy that's uh, one of our Action Sports Live athletes, Miles, and another guy, Andrew, uh, that are base jumping and uh, probably base jumping today. Yeah! Alright, I'm looking for a wave. I want to just annihilate a wave. Now, hopefully the surf, and you can, you can see up, that's north, you can see there's four kite surfers that are doing a downwinder from up in Hope Sound, which is about 20 miles north that way. Down that way south is Miami and Fort Lauderdale, and you can see that uh, you can see that there's the that's the uh, Juno Beach Pier right there. And if you guys are typing in comments, I'll respond to your comments later. I can't see them right now, obviously, because I've got you. I've got my uh, my camera. I've got my phone, my iPhone on my head. I'm not using a GoPro right now, so I know I get. I always get a lot of questions about that. But yeah, I'm not using a, a GoPro. five billion people on Facebook and because I don't have to use you know an external service to allow the video to, to live longer so you know if you're a my agency you know what we do is we help brands and businesses basically get more business using live stream and leveraging these tools because um, you know I know I've done a lot of them I've been a speaker at the Periscope Summit and I'm going to be speaking wrong on August 8th at the uh, live video campus with Kathy Hackle and Kim Garst. Woo! All right, where's the wave? Where's the wave, baby? Woo! Yeah. I'm looking for anything. Come on, baby.
Yeah!